Egypt's military recently arrested some divers, not because they are poaching, not because they just happen to be in, in wrong water waters doing something uh, not quite kosher. Well, actually, they were doing something quite not kosher. They were actually cutting an internet cable that went to that country. Apparently, the Coast Guard over there arrested uh, three divers in the act of sabotage of the cutting the cables that connect the, that Africa, Europe, the Middle East, and Asia. Apparently, this it had happened back in 2009 or 2008. It, they had a trio of outages. They thought that were caused by weather or a ship anchor, you know, come along. Now, these cables uh, are on the ocean floor. That's how we communicate with the whole uh, rest of the world. They, they take out these big boats with long, big-ass cables on them. They're probably, I don't know if they're uh, maybe this thick or probably as thick as my body, maybe. I'm not really sure. I, I've never actually seen one. Uh, but I, I, I'm guessing because they have to be sit on the ocean floor, and the only way you know that they're there is they come up where they come up on land in certain locations. These cables are the lifeblood and for so we can connect to the rest of the world. These people, what they were doing, like I said, they were down there in and swimming on, underneath, going down, and they were cutting the cables. This is pretty serious. I hope that they prosecute these uh, divers to the fullest extent of the law, and I, I'm, I'm hoping that these are the only ones that are out there doing it. But there's a lot of militant factions out there that, because information and knowledge for them is a terrible thing because if they know, if their people find out about stuff, then they they'll they think they're fearful that they'll riot or they'll say hey this is bullshit why are we believing this shit that you're telling us and all these other places are not doing this or whatever but it's it's a fascinating story uh joe your thoughts yeah i've read about this before the internet is a physical thing mm -hmm. undersea data cables wrap like a spider web all around the world and they get cut all the time most of these cuts are blamed on the weather or on sea anchors from ships being low. You know, right. they lower the anchor and, oh, you know, they didn't know it was down there. Right. Uh, there's actually cable laying ships that stand at the ready in many parts of the world, ready to go out there and put down new cable when they get cut. Right. Because, you know, we don't want to lose our Netflix. I don't so, want to lose uh, my Netflix. Well, I don't have Netflix <laughs> anyway, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> you're, you're a Hulu man. So, uh, yeah, so I tried to find an update on this article. Uh, as to the motivations of these divers. Mm -hmm. And so uh, what I found, I found an article from a few days after this article, and the motivations still remain unclear. Uh, there's some speculation that it might have been politically motivated, but by cutting this one cable, it mm -hmm. wouldn't have disconnected all of Egypt from the rest of the world. It would just make Egypt really slow. Mm. So they were going through a lot of effort to just be douches. <laughs> I'm going to make your internet very slow. This is internet 1999. <laughs> <laughs> you are on 56k cable now. Yes. All right. Uh, <laughs> do you have anything else to add on that, there, Joe? Uh, dog thinks what I said was kind of funny. <laughs> He's such a pervert. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> Dawkins, dog, you are a perv. Thank you for coming to the show. Uh <laughs> Welcome home. Welcome home. Crystal, your thoughts? Oh, gosh, I was like, Jay, I was trying to find out um, if they had released a, 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 a reason. Why were they doing it? And I couldn't get a decent answer either. And it seems like that Telecom Egypt still is not releasing any information as to who these people are, mm -hmm. who they're connected with, what their motivation was. Um and, and it was the only thing being is Alexandria, where they found the mat. They carry that that cable area carries more than seventy five percent mm -hmm. of their internet yep. traffic. Yep. So that would affect a whole lot of people. Wouldn't take it down, but it sure would affect a lot of people. And uh. Oh yeah, absolutely. I, I mean, just it was kind of interesting to find out if we were to actually find the truth out. Right, and what, it also takes what was their reasoning. That's a lot of work to go do, just like he said, just to be a douche, just to piss people off. What? Yeah. What's your reason? Yeah, and it also takes out their telecommunications and their telephones, basically, too. So and probably was... their porn, and that would be enough. <laughs> no, you must not take my porn. I must see camel. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just... <laughs> that was, no, oh, that's terrible. Those three guys are getting flogged in an Egyptian prison right now. I hope so. <laughs> you shall not take my internet, or my Egyptian porn from me. <laughs> you tried to inflict DSL on us. <laughs> 
camel porn, all that humping. Uh, mm. <laughs> Thank you once again, Dawkins. Dog. <laughs> yes. <laughs> He's just like too quick. He's really quick. He's sharp. He's sharp.